Around the boards, waiting for it is William Carlson. He'll play it back for Nate Schmidt. Doing a real good job, Dennis, of controlling the clock, keeping the flow going, and ticking off time off the remaining 2.40 in this third. Cody Eakin deflects it into the bench, goes Mark andre Fleury for the extra attacker. Kept in at the line by Shea Theodore. Theodore plays it down low. Around the boards for James Neal. Neal corner for Eakin, in for Perron. David Perron at the line, six attackers. Perron on the right side to the goal line. He goes, Cody Eakin, sharp angle, and Connor Hellebuck makes the save. And Hellebuck will hang on with Morrissey down on the short side, helping out his net miner as there was all sorts of traffic at the short side. Go Jets! Left on the clock in a 4-2 game for the Jets. Well, they're their top two defensemen, the number one pair. How good have Josh Morrissey and Jacob Truba been here tonight? Connor Hellebuck made the initial save, and then there's just been nothing. Either the puck's been covered by the goal, or it's been played up. Timeout Vegas here with over two minutes left to go, and they've elected to pull net finder Mark andre Fleury. Face-off will be in the just end of the ice. We are in the Payworks broadcast booth. Payworks, more than payroll. Visit payworks.ca. Just one more reminder, Monday's game, 7 o'clock here at Bell FBS Place. Well, Winnipeg has been in this situation a few times over the course of the playoffs. Twice they scored empty netters. In fact, three empty netters against Nashville in that series. And they certainly had the opportunity with a couple of empty netters in the Minnesota series. So we'll see how they control it. But they're not adverse to the situation. They feel good about winning draws. And they feel real good about winning the puck battle to get the puck to center ice to shoot it to the empty goal. So obviously with some experience, there is comfort. Stastny out. Paul Stastny offensively now with 13 points in the last nine games for the Winnipeg Jets. They're on their feet here as well as the Slate to the attack for the Golden Knights. Sharp angle shot there by Blake Wheeler will chip it out of center right and back to the Vegas line. Taken by Colin Miller. Two minutes now left to go in the third period. Miller taps a misfire. Great score and a nice team call. William Carlson is going to hard And Jacob Kuda. This is where he back with Carlson. And the face shot goes him all the way back into the Vegas zone. in by Brandon Tennis. Shea Theodore will try it down to the bench. Goes Flurry as they'll send it in. Carlson off the board, tied up there with Dustin Buckley. Buckley battles with three. Carlson back at the line for Colin Miller and back for Carlson. He gets chased back to the line by tied by Adam Lowry. Broken up by Dustin Bufflin. Adam Lowry on the backhand. Up at center. Lowry comes right wide for Myers at the open net. And a glove saved by William Carlson, who was back playing goal. One minute now left to go in regulation. Bouncing puck in on Helmut. One minute! And he will grab it. And the faceoff will be in the jet zone as Helmut will hang on to it with pressure coming. Just the fourth time in the Stanley Cup playoffs so far, the Golden Knights have given up four goals against. Prior two times were both against the San Jose Sharks in Game 2. They lost 4-3 in overtime. And then, of course, were shut out in Game 4. Winnipeg gets four against them here tonight. Trying to get to five here if they can pull it in the empty net. Take it in the corner to the front of the net for Ryan Carpenter. Scramble in front of the net. That got cleared. 
Back in behind the net, Carpenter couldn't trap it. Makes its way to the near side. Howell plays it back down low. Shifley trying to get a handle on it in the jet zone. Morrissey bats it ahead for Shifley. Shifley stopped at the line. Quick shot by Nate Schmidt. Blocked in front. Cleared away by Morrissey and cleared away by Wheeler up to center ice. Nate Schmidt back into his own zone. Schmidt puts on the brakes. Plays it back up at center ice for Howla. Howla will send it in. Off the board. Kellamuck will leave it there for Morrissey. Tracy down low to knock it back in behind the Jets net. Everybody piles in behind the net. Perron gets a stick up on Morrissey. Shot from the line blocked by Wheeler. Scramble for a loose puck. Kellamuck is down. It's cleared. At the line. Kept in. Down below. Lindbergh for Neal. Blocked. And this one will come to an end. And the Winnipeg Jets defeat the Vegas Golden Knights by a score of 4-2 and take a one game to lead, one game to nothing lead in this best of seven Western Conference final. Jets with three in the first, Buffalo, Lani, Armia made it 3-0 and they ride those three goals to the 4-2 win.